Hey, what's up everybody? This is Alex on Casuals and today we are going to be playing Guild Wars 2 and we are going to uh, give you a small uh, guide on uh, crafting. In particular, it's going to be tailoring in my case, but uh, it should be similar to for all professions. So uh, obviously you will need to show up to a tailoring station or your station that you need in your city. Um, most um, profession discipline will require uh, materials that come from the vendor. So in this case, I'm already a pretty high in tailoring. So um, I'm going to buy, I already bought uh, spools of silk thread, which is going to be uh, required for me to craft. Um, in your collection for tailoring in particular, uh, I need a uh, plot, obviously. Uh, so I took all the uh, silk scrap, uh, bowl of silk, blah, 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 thick leather um, section that I had. And then once you have all these mats, also make sure to take the fine crafting materials that you have of that uh, level. So I took all the those that I needed in this row. And then um, once it's all in your inventory, make sure to go in your um, production tab. You go at the bottom where you uh, transform all your uh, silk scrap into bolt of silk and all your thick leather blah 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 into whatever else. And then uh, you're pretty much ready to craft. So the first thing you want to do is um, I craft uh, insignas. Uh, insignia, I usually make four of them, four of each type if I can. You can do six if you want, uh, but it's gonna cost you a bit more materials. Uh, I do four because then what you will need to do is go up a bit, let me find it. And basically what I'm gonna do is do, I'm gonna skip the coats and the leggings because they cost a bit more materials. Um, See, they cost four and three, it's kind of expensive. I'm just going to go with uh, shoulders, gloves, elms, and uh, shoes. And then what it, what you need to do is craft two, one of each, but like two of each, like, how can I explain this? Uh, like, since I have four, is it four? Yeah. I'm going to already craft my insignias. So right now I only have these insignias, so I have three different insignias, but I have four of each. So what I need to do is craft three of this and then this is like a step one of, of the shoulders and then this, this is step two of the shoulder. Then you do this for all of them, for the gloves, for um, the elm, so two pair of gloves which are different parts of the glove, then two part uh, of the elm three times because I have three uh, type of insignias right now. Um, elm, scrap, alright, three more, and then I'm going to do the shoes, three as well, also this will give you experience, uh, every level you will gain XP, so it's pretty decent XP, I gotta say, it's pretty good, so once you crafted all your crafting component, you have your insignias and everything, you can go into the discovery tab, and this, uh, if you like, you're not too experienced or whatever, it can be confusing, but basically you're going to match the two uh, type of uh, equipment of component like a two piece of glove and a rune and an insignia I mean then you discover it then you just learn a new recipe it gives you a lot of XP's then you're gonna repeat it with different insignia and then uh, yep again and then uh, once you're done with the gloves uh, then you move on to the next piece we're gonna go the helmet so yeah, this obviously is going to be uh, demanding in materials a lot. Uh, you can always use the market to uh, fuel your materials if you don't have them all. Uh, but it can be tricky sometimes. So, But yeah, this is just uh, the basics of the tailoring in general for crafting. Uh, then we're going to do the uh, shoes, the two part of the shoes and the insignia. And uh, you just repeat this until uh, you level up to the skill level you want, obviously 400. Um, this is a pretty, uh, it can be time consuming and uh, cost quite a lot of money if you use the market to uh, rely on your your materials. And I'm almost done here for this batch of stuff that I have. I'm going to match this. And I think I craft, oh yeah, I craft these twice because I, <laughs> I craft some before starting the video. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter, I'll use them somewhere else. So yeah, uh, this is pretty straightforward, and then um, eventually you will unlock more insignias. See now I can craft uh, these ones, so I'm gonna go ahead and craft four of each. This is pretty straightforward. Four of each, and I'm gonna have four different type. 
So, like I said, it's going to be uh, pretty, um, it's easy to learn when you see it. When, when you just start, it's a bit confusing, I guess. So, yet again, we're going to go ahead and four shoulders of this part, four shoulders of this part. Actually, I just remember I had shoulders. Fuck me. <laughs> Doesn't matter. All right. Uh, four gloves of this part. No, I said four. Whoa. All right. Four. Including the one I just got. All right. That's four. Um, now this part of the glove four times. Then the element four times. And then the scrap of the helmet four times. Then the shoes. And uh, yeah, basically the the crafting how it works in this game differently to any other game that I've seen really much about crafting is that you don't craft like 15 billion times the same thing, like 15 million bags or whatever. It's really about discovering new recipes. So it's uh, an interesting feature, I gotta say. So yeah, you take your two type of gloves, mix it with an Insigna, rinse and repeat until um, you're done with your glove and then you move on to the next type of gear it's pretty easy I hope you guys uh, most of you guys will understand this I without a doubt I'm sure all right whoops we're now done with the gloves now we're gonna move on with the helmet all right now that this has been done a few more insignias for the helmet then we're gonna move on to another piece of equipment and you can see in my combat chat uh, I've put the XP uh, tab, and even though I'm level 80, uh, I keep uh, gaining XPs, and uh, every time I level up, it gives me a skill point, which uh, can be used to buy some uh, some crafting materials and stuff like that. So uh, that's always nice. All right, I think we're almost done. 3:50. Nah, nah, nah. Alright, so uh, yeah, my crafting is getting almost up there, almost 400. This is my last piece and I'm missing, oh, the shoulders, I think. Those that I craft in excess, it doesn't matter. I'll use them somewhere else. I'll find it, I'll find it. So. So yeah, if you have the materials, definitely do this while you're leveling up. It's going to be a lot of XP's. If you can uh, do lots of batches in a row. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, I think. I mean, it's basic leveling. Uh, at some point, the when you're near the end of your your tier, if you want, uh, leveling is going to be a bit rougher, and you're going to have these new insignias that take a lot more materials uh, that you probably won't be able to craft all that many of them. So we're going to go ahead and craft them. One, two. Whoops! Did I just? Yeah, I just leveled up. All right, craft all. And this one we're gonna craft all two of them. Actually I could craft more, but I'm running out of spool soul thread, so we're gonna stop by the vendor real quick. And we're gonna buy this should be plenty. Alright, uh, where was I? Alright, so three more. I think that should be four total, so that's perfect. So let me just verify. Shit, I got five. So since I have one more, I'm gonna have to do uh, either a chest piece or a uh, leggings, which is no big deal. And these ones only have one of each. <clears throat> All you have, you know what? I'm gonna do it for uh, this, I guess. All right, these extra shoulders that I bought earlier. All right, so I need. All right, let's do shoulders first, I guess. Uh, whoops, I think I passed it. All right, so I'm gonna need three more shoulders. Actually, you know what? We're gonna do a uh, helmet first because I think it's a bit less materials. Uh, why is this? Let's see. All right, yeah. So let's do three helmets. And then uh, match him with whatever runes. Actually, I should have made four helmets. <coughs> I just realized. Doesn't matter, we're gonna get rid of these extra insignias that uh, have been sitting there a bit. Alright, so I got one more for the helmet. I'm gonna go make that right now. Helmet, where are you? I'm kinda running low on silk, which is not a good thing, but um, <clears throat> might have to stop by the auction house. 
All right. And um, yeah, I'm gonna stop this here because I mean, I think you guys got a process of, uh, at least for artillery, I'm pretty sure this other prof professions are gonna be pretty similar, maybe except jewel crafting and cooking, I'm not sure, but um, the rest I'm pretty sure is gonna be pretty similar, so. Oh, and before I end this, uh, you can always, uh, when you're running out of materials like me in this case, uh, you can either sell all the stuff that you crafted, which is blues and greens, whatever, or you can just salvage it. Uh, personally, I just use a basic salvage kit. I don't really care that much. I just uh, salvage everything pretty much, and uh, from there it's gonna give me a ton of. Um, it's gonna give me a lot of silk, so it's gonna help me progress my crafting without me having to go on the auction house, you know. And I'm am I out of salvage kit? God damn it! All right, doesn't matter. But yeah, you guys get a point, so uh, do it. But um, yeah, I hope this uh, tutorial helped you guys for crafting in Guild Wars 2. And uh, yeah, make sure to leave a comment and subscribe. Thank you.